The Phantom 3 is listed as an office and gaming chair hybrid, with the emphasis clearly being on the practicality of the product. So how does it hold up in everyday use? I've been trialling it during both work hours and through some pretty gruelling gaming sessions for a few weeks now. So how did it perform? Let's start with the packaging and how easy it was to put together. Upon receiving the Phantom 3, I immediately noticed how well packaged it was. As soon as you open the box, everything is securely fitted with no chance of it being damaged in transit. One thing that really stood out to me whilst unpacking the product was how few parts there were to it. I had to double check that they hadn't forgotten to send me anything as it was literally just the seat, the backrest and the wheels. The only other items in there were some screws and the tilt contraption that secures the wheels to the chair. As well as this, they provided an extremely in-depth user manual that had clear and concise instructions, along with actual images of the assembly process, so at no point was I confused as to what to do next. The wheels popped straight onto the base, which was probably the most satisfying part of the assembly. From there, it was a bit of a struggle to attach the backrest to the seat, as the screws provided didn't seem to fit correctly. It was all very clear and easy to follow the steps, but they just didn't seem to want to tighten. I'm not sure whether this was just a problem for myself, but unfortunately it did slow down the assembling process a fair bit and was quite frustrating to deal with. Aside from that though, the rest was extremely straightforward. You're supplied with all of the correct screws and bolts, and are even given an incredibly practical Allen key that is far superior to anything I've seen included with a product before. One other thing that I really liked were the magnetic safety covers to go over the screws that attach the backrest to the seat. They snapped on really easily and can be removed in seconds if you need to access that section again to tighten or loosen any screws. Once the chair was built, all of the mechanisms worked perfectly and it felt very solid. I'd say it took around 30 to 45 minutes in total to put together, but that's including the struggle I had attaching the backrest. So if you don't encounter that issue, then I'd say you could have this thing built in 20 minutes easily. In terms of rating, the Phantom 3 gets a 3 out of 5 for assembly, which definitely could be higher if you don't face the same issues that I did. One of my favourite things about the chair is just how comfortable it is. You could easily sit in it all day if you really wanted to, which I can say from experience as I quite literally haven't left it until I stood up to do this review. The shape of the seat is perfect and has incredibly comfortable padding. Both the main seat and the backrest seem to mould to your body when you're sitting down and have an extremely solid feel to them. They're also both pretty wide which allows for a variety of different body shapes and sizes, and that's definitely a big positive of the Phantom 3. The comfort when sitting is definitely where you'll notice the quality of the product, whether it's in the materials, shape or sturdiness. The fabric is premium and you're extremely well supported. The one thing I don't particularly like is how rigid the backrest is. This is a chair that's supposed to improve your posture, which is a great idea, don't get me wrong, but sometimes I just want to lie back and chill out, which isn't the easiest thing to do with the Phantom 3. To alter the angle of the backrest, you need to pull up this lever at the side and adjust it manually. But once you've done that, the back is stuck in that position, meaning you have to have a few tries adjusting it before you can get it feeling just right. This might be a personal preference, but I like to be able to lean back on my chair and have the backrest move back with me, which isn't possible with this model. It makes it a brilliant work chair though if you need your posture corrected and maintained during long hours, but does mean that it isn't the most relaxing chair to sit in as it doesn't have that flexibility. The included lumbar support pillow and headrest are very comfortable though. The materials used feel premium and soft, whilst being sturdy enough to keep everything in line. The headrest straps to the top of the chair and is adjustable to fit to your required height, however the lumbar support isn't. Unfortunately this is just a back pillow which you have to manually align every time you want to sit down. In terms of functionality, the pillow is actually great. It offers a good amount of support and moulds to your back perfectly. It's just a little frustrating having to pick it up and adjust it every time you want to sit down, but overall it's really not too much of a negative. The wheels and armrests are fairly standard to be honest. There's nothing inherently wrong with them, but they certainly don't feel as premium as the seat itself. Again, it's not something I would count as a negative per se, but for the price of the chair it would have been nice to have more adjustable options for the armrests, which have a pretty limited range of heights. I wouldn't hold this against the chair though, as for me the most important thing is getting the seat right. As far as I'm concerned, the wheels and armrests just have to be somewhat comfy and functional. Overall, this chair is extremely comfortable. I had a fairly standard office chair before, which was okay, but quickly became uncomfortable after an hour or so. The step up from that to the Phantom 3 was immediately noticeable, and I've thoroughly enjoyed my time using it over the last few weeks. And for that reason, for comfort, it's getting a very solid 4 out of 5. Depending on what you're looking for in a gaming chair, the aesthetics may or may not be a priority for you. 
For me, one of the first things I noticed was just how good this chair looked right out of the box. I could easily see this being in any environment that you could think of, whether it be an office or at home. I personally received the linen fabric model which comes decked out in a lovely grey exterior that's subtle and modern. It really would look great in any setting. The other option you can buy is the premium PVC leather model which comes in black, white and pink. If you're looking for an extremely subtle look that's even more professional, the Stormy Black option definitely provides that. Similarly, if you want a more gaming vibe, you can go for white or pink. This makes the chair extremely versatile, which, for its price, is certainly important. With the huge surge in jobs allowing staff to work from home, it's really important to have a nice chair that's going to support your back and also stay comfortable for prolonged periods of time. And for me, the Underseat Phantom 3 ticks all of those boxes. I'd go as far as saying it's the perfect chair for office work due to the almost enforced posture it puts on you and the aforementioned subtle and professional look. If you're someone that works from home and needs a new desk chair, it's well worth considering the Phantom 3. Due to all of those reasons combined, I'm going to give the Underseat Phantom 3 a 5 out of 5 for aesthetics. I honestly wouldn't want anything more from the way it looks. It's extremely versatile and will be my office chair for many years to come. So I just want to quickly address the price of the chair, as this is a big thing if you're looking for a new one to buy. At retail price, you'll be paying around $450, but I've been tracking the site for a while now and there are often discounts for it that save you around $50. Even with the discount though, the price is still pretty high. It's difficult to say whether or not the price is worth it, as everyone's priorities and situations are different. But from my experience, you're buying a quality product that will help your physical health while you're stagnant. If you're considering a new chair and are willing to spend upwards of $200, then I'd definitely recommend spending that extra money to guarantee a good experience for years to come. It also comes with a two-year warranty that covers missing parts, product defects, and other things like that so you can be assured that you'll be receiving a quality product for at least two years. But of course, it still depends on what your budget is. The price is fairly in line with other gaming chairs of its quality, such as Secret Labs, but is still pretty steep. In terms of value for money, I'm going to give the Phantom 3 a 4 out of 5. I'd say if you're looking for support, sturdiness, and a clean and subtle look, the Underseat Phantom 3 would be the perfect chair for you. However, if you're wanting a more casual chair that you can loaf around in and feel comfortable sitting in whichever way you like, this might not be the chair for you. Overall though, the Underseat Phantom 3 scores an extremely respectable rating of 16 out of 20 from us, and I would highly recommend it for sure. If you've enjoyed our review of the Underseat Phantom 3, you'll be sure to enjoy this other review that I've kindly put on screen for you now.